If you're here today and you are wrestling with deep hurts and there are pains and they are legitimate, obviously they're legitimate, and I don't want to discount that, I want to encourage you, give it to God. Amen. Start releasing it to God and see what God can do with it. I believe that for some of us, I, we're going to be offended, we're going to be hurt. It'll happen in our workplace, it'll happen in our relationships, and instead many times we want to jump out of that and just try to find the perfect relationship, the perfect workplace, the perfect church, when in reality, you're always going to be offended, amen? It's just going to happen. What is God trying to do with you, work out in you when you're hurt? I think many times, you're, I think God is trying to make us more compassionate to others who have been hurt. Where you can now sympathize with someone else's pain. Maybe he's trying to develop a deeper prayer life in you. Where you're now not just praying for me and my house and my family, but Lord, I pray for my enemies. Just because you have made up your mind to forgive someone doesn't mean you now need to trust them. The Bible over and over again commands us to walk in forgiveness and to forgive one another. We're commanded to do that. But nowhere in the Bible does it say we have to trust everyone. Instead, the Bible is, it tells us you need to test someone. See, trust is earned. It's built up. Forgiveness, it's an act, it's a decision, it's a way of thinking where I say, I'm no longer gonna hold this against them. I pardon them, I forgive them, I release them of my own vengeance. I'm gonna give this thing to God. Forgiveness is not about the other person. It's about you, it's about you, it's about your heart. About are you walking in the gospel? Have you been affected by the gospel? Have you been infected with forgiveness where now it's contagious and you have to give it out to other people? That's forgiveness. Sometimes we hold on to hurt because we're like, this is how I'm gonna get back at them. Oh, that, I'm, we hold on to it. We hold on to the hurt and we wanna hold it against them and we just kind of replay it in our mind and like, oh yeah, they did that. And oh, if I could, I'd say this to them. We, in our minds, it's like a form of punishment against them. But the truth is they moved on. Yeah.